Hi, you're watching Hexus TV, and we've come away from the Computex 2010 Expo to have a chat with David from BitPhoenix. Hi, David. Hello, sir. Welcome. <laughs> thank you. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm very good. Now, could you uh, tell us a bit about BitPhoenix first, for those that haven't heard of you? Uh, absolutely. Um, we are a new company, uh, but certainly not new people. Um, we've all been working around this industry for quite a while now, and... Uh, have uh, you know been friends outside of work? Many of us have been working together in the past, and uh, after uh, some long nights and a lot of talking, we uh, kind of figure out that uh, we should do something together to do our own thing. Yeah, do it our way. Okay, so after a while of doing it other people's way, you decided to get together and do it your own uh, way. Something along those lines, yeah. Okay. Um, so you've got a couple of cases to show us. That's right. Um, we got a couple of prototypes here for our first generation of BitPhoenix cases. Uh, big guy, Colossus. Uh, smaller guy, Survivor. Uh, okay, the, so the, the, this white one here is the Colossus. This is the Colossus. Obviously, it's the big one. It's <laughs> yep. colossal. Uh, Survivor, it's getting the name Survivor because it's, uh, it's not so much a ruggedized look, but it will have ruggedized features, so to speak. Uh, we're rubber coating it. Uh, we're thinking about uh, putting some rubber details on the frames on the sides so it can take a few bumps if you throw it in the trunk of your car or bring it on the bus going to a friend's house or land party and so on. Okay, can yeah. you go have a look at that one? Then? Absolutely. So, okay, so what have we got on, the, uh, on this one? Uh, on Survivor, well, first of all, it's a mid-tower chassis, uh, ATX sized. Uh, you have pretty big fans still. Uh, two 230 millimeter fans, intake and exhaust. Uh, we're also adding 14 centimeter intakes and exhausts through the bottom and through the back respectively. So you'll have a, a, a very balanced airflow. Same CFM going in as going out. Okay. Uh, still talking about fans, you see we have a huge meshed side panel here. Something we're kind of still working on, where to put the fan locations, if we should put fan locations there. Uh, obviously, you've got to worry about the height of CPU coolers and things like that. So, um, But if you've got some, some, some LEDs and some LED cooling and stuff in there, that would look really nice because of the, uh, the mesh. If you put LED fans in there, you'll be able to uh, see the nice glow from your fans, correct? Good, good for pimping out, then. Yes, for all the pimps. Okay, so let's have a look at the Colossus then. It's shiny and white, Everything. and it's yeah. glowing blue. Uh, this is the white version. We're also making a black version. Uh, it turned out, we tried different materials, different coatings, turned out that the white version actually looks better in gloss. So we'll keep that one glossy, whereas the black version will be more of a matte finish. Okay. Uh, we're thinking about doing the rubber coating on that one too because it's ah, right. so same, same as the Survivor. really, really nice touch feeling. I noticed uh, the combination lock on the top. Yeah, uh, that's uh, one of our security features here. Um, there's a lid on top. If you can catch this on the camera. Uh, that goes into the top secret uh, storage compartment. I see, I spy USB 3 port at the back, I think. There is one USB 3 and one USB 2 at the moment. Uh, so you'll be able to put like a high-speed hard drive in there, uh, USB drives, even recharging your phone or MP3 player or whatever. And uh, it can all be connected and locked down with a code lock so no one can copy your key. And uh, we can kind of leave it there doing its business, keep on copying files or recharging, leave the room or your seat at the LAN party if you care to lug this beast to a LAN party. <laughs> uh, you can do that too. So it's better than leaving your stuff on your desk because you can just leave it locked away in, in your PC? Obviously, yes. That's the idea. OK, any other cool features of the Colossus? Many other cool features on the Colossus. Uh, of course, we got this uh, sexy lighting system here. Uh, you can change the uh, color of the lights, red, blue, only two colors so far. Uh, we'll see if we add more before mass production. And also a couple of different light modes. You can turn off the lights if lights are not your style or if you just want to kind of watch a movie or go to bed and you don't want the whole room lit up. Mm -hmm. Or 
kind of a slow breathing effect. It's also something we're fine tuning now. Uh, it's a little bit fast, in my opinion. So I'm guessing the drive bays are all stashed away behind the front panel. Uh, the big ODD bays are all behind the panel. There you go. Open the door. And can I get a mouse over here? I cannot. We'll, we, we can take a look at that later. So all the way on the front, uh, also big fan, 230 millimeter fan. All the intakes on all the Bit Phoenix chassis will always be uh, filtered, always dust filters. OK. Yeah. You can't see it now, but there's a cleanable, removable dust filter behind this. Uh, also for the PSU intake and the bottom fan, they all have dust filters. So another feature we've been working on is uh, it's, it's, it's kind of a common problem, something I've been experiencing myself quite a lot. Uh, I have cables hanging down in front of my DVD burners yeah. because of front I.O. is usually in, up here. So your, cab your cables will hang in front of the DVDs. Uh, you get trapped. Your, yeah. They get trapped in the sled whenever you eject your CDs and so on. So we have opened some cable routing grooves here on the sides. They all got teeth, so you can kind of secure the cable there. It will stay in place, and you can pull it down the sides of the bezel instead and exit through the bottom or a top location. It kind of depends on where you want to put your chassis. Do you put your computer on the floor? You might want the cable to come out a little bit higher up. Yeah. Uh, if it's on your desk, you want it to come out a little bit lower down. OK, great. Well, that's uh, Bit Phoenix's Survivor and Colossus chassis. You're watching Hexus TV. Come back more soon for more from Computex 2010.